one. Uh, they did each have a chance to veto one mode. Bonta vetoed swordless. Rarik actually vetoed vanilla swords. And so they chose uh, retro animizer. R retro was Rarik's choice. Animizer was Bonta's choice. Yeah, I played a, a bunch of retro in in attorney, uh, and actually never played any fast Ganon, despite it being its seventh, uh, seven, uh, sorry, nineteenth match. And we have seen the red crystal on the Tower Fera and a pendant on Eastern. And a crystal on desert, is that right? So, if you're not familiar with retro, I mean, Animizer is pretty self explanatory. All the enemies are mixed up. <laughs> but uh, if you're not familiar with retro, differences are that there, there is a general pool for small keys that can be used in any dungeon. Um, you have to buy arrows, arrows cost rupees to fire. And uh, I'm trying to think of the other little things. Uh, there's caves that can have a sword in it. So... Yep. Or that's actually, exactly why, yeah, that's exactly why Highwick is entering this uh, lumberjack house that normally you, you never see. There's a small chance that he has a, a sword or a take any, so like a heart and a, a blue potion refill, is that right? Yep. Uh, I, think it's, I think it's blue, yeah. Yeah, I and think it's blue. A, but yeah, there's, there's four caves with either a heart or a blue potion, and then there's one cave that has a sword. Yeah, and how fun that we see Bonta going for the escape when Highwick is gone for uh, for the village and the forest. While well, there are plenty of enemies in the forest right now, and he's dodging all of them. This is definitely a bit of a risky proposition going with just bombs, because you, you, you don't know how well the enemies are going to kill our... So you don't know how easy these enemies are going to be killed with bombs. Now, uh, that first one was easy enough. Those ping gators die in one hit with a bomb. <laughs> yeah, but it could like could be a pokey. It could be anything that's really, really harsh to, to kill with bombs. So, yeah. Uh, what a dicey play in the in the very beginning of this finals. But it's really bonta like you know. He, he plays like that. He likes, to have, he, he likes to have fun in his seats. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> Ah, and the tech tag, yeah, the blue tech tag is hard to hit. Very volatile enemy. <laughs> yeah, wow. <laughs> Dodging like a pro master. Okay, he killed it. Right, that one's and a just, easier. <laughs> yeah, just a tiny, tiny bit easier. <laughs> okay, nice. He got the key, and well, he set up for a death warp, actually. So, that's nice. Potentially going for a dark room and then a miser. <laughs> wow, possible. Well,. I don't think so. Even though it's Bonta, it's really, really good. But come on, like no, that that is ridiculous. Like the the, I, the dark room with the six snakes. That's <laughs> oh, Lionel. Oh, nice, um, nice, nice, Lionel. No, nah, I think he he just took that damage intention or not intentionally, unintentionally. But he uh, he picked up the heart there. It does get uh, does get the enemy. Nothing there though. I did see Rara pick up some flippers. Yep, and it got. A well, he got flippers and bombs. J Highwag just got 20 rupees and a green rupee. So, I think that's the one sword they took out of the pool. Because oh, right. Because when they put when they put the sword in the cave, they do take one out of the pool. Yeah, that's right. Because there's nothing else in here that should take that out. Yeah, it's not hard mode, it's not hard functionality, whatever. So, they have everything in the game. Uh, hearts and swords and uh, mails extra is not replaced by 20 rupees. So I, I, I thought it was odd, but no, it's okay. And Quake, the bacon, I've been fun in a well. And the first key, because yeah, that's I think that's the most interesting thing with uh, with retro. It's the fact that you have just one pool of key that you will uh, use them from. And, you, and there's also like a shop, that, a few shops that you can buy keys for 100 rupees yep that's one thing that uh, both runners are going to want to do at some point is establish a shop where they can buy keys if they need to as well as they're going to need to find the arrows that they have to buy oh and the cuckoo house is well it's filled <laughs> with uh, the soldiers we call the ocean bolts well he gets through there but he might die coming out of here oh, another... uh, oh God. that's weird uh is it is it arrows? Actually, no. Arrows are replaced by. Five. At least they were replaced by uh, five rupees. Um, huh. Maybe it's hard. Oh, to did you see the? 
I don't know. Did yeah. you see the 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 cuckoo uh, the cuckoo under the <laughs> under the bush? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nice. Like nicely done. He has he only has one bomb, and Rywick just went for the uh, the bomb refill. Nice, nicely done. I, I don't know if it's if it can be like a shop in retro, but I think it's nice play. Bit risky. He only has one heart. Right now, anything could kill him under this bush. Okay, that's fine. But for the moment, it's a bit empty in uh, in Kakariko. Where is Ryuk going? Oh yeah, the the back. Of, okay, back of the bar. Okay, he didn't go. It didn't go there before. And the mirror. Okay. That's nice. Early on, uh, Tower of Ferro is a red crystal, so could be interesting. Well, there's our first take, Annie. Where it takes a heart. Yep. As it, as and... it, go ahead. No, no, sorry, sorry, go ahead. I was gonna say, I was just looking through the rules to see about those. Oh, there's another take, Annie. <laughs> Yep. Um, <laughs> back to back. So yeah, the I confirmed that yeah, the sword is taken out of the pool. The heart containers aren't though, so it is actually possible in this mode to get over the twenty hearts. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, true, true. So some swords are, are taken out. So that's why we we found two green twenties. Hey, <laughs> thank you, Julien Bernard, <laughs> for the sub. Uh, for the French community, I just played with him this afternoon. Playing some multi world. Really, really fun. But you know, a uh, small fun fact this is the third tourney, and this is the very first time a Canadian has actually been part of the finals. Rayweek is the first one. Yep, that is correct. Despite, you know, like, uh, prox like 50 55 percent of the community is Canadian, uh, mostly Europeans are, are good at the game, apparently. <laughs> I'm going to get some messages after this uh, this broadcast from angry Canadian people. <laughs> oh well. So we're, we're seeing some different strategies. Ryuk is going for the, the t trying to find these caves, trying to find that sword in the cave. Vanta is basically ignoring. Yep. I I don't know if Vanta does a lot of retro. Maybe he's not used to it. But he, ha he has had like a, a few days to know that this was a this was a retro seed. I think. I mean, it's it's not a bad strategy to just ignore them because for the most part, they just have heart containers. It really comes down to where the sword is and if Rarwick does find it, because yep, the sword advantage it could help him. in this, yeah. Now, if it's gold versus tempered, it's not that big of an advantage. But it's say if it's tempered versus master, that could be big. Yeah, tempered versus master is like a whole new world for them. Uh, really, really big difference in terms of time saving, uh, because you kill enemies so fast. Oh, and Rayweek, what are you doing? There are nice spikes on the <laughs> top of the mountain there. Yeah. Looks like he's gonna go for Ag Agina. Oh yeah, yeah, right. Uh, there's Agina, and there's also this cave that could be the sword. Maybe. Can you name or list these retro shops want to learn this win mode? Uh, I think there's some resources on the, the website. I'm not uh, yeah, sure about are, that. There are resources out there that list all of, like where all the shops are and um, which shops you can check. In terms of the take any caves, it's literally any cave that doesn't lead anywhere in coordinates. Yeah, so it. Any cave that doesn't have any way to contain progression. Actually, yeah, any, without progression, I think it also can't be connector caves. Oh, yeah, true. That's right. So it doesn't mess with uh, with entrance from the maze. Hey, a nice high five in Agatha's cave. Nine minutes in. And um, how funny that they don't really have many rupees to play with. And how funny they both go for Agna so early on. Oh, that's a good thing they do. <laughs> Hype! Hype boots. Wow, the boots in Agnes Cave are like less than 10 minutes in. Wow, that's really good. Like, such a... <laughs> I'm befuddled. That's, that's it. I, I'm really amazed that they found the boots so early. 
Now they're both probably thinking, oh good, I found that. Maybe my opponent won't get that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, both of them might think that the other one didn't get it yet. But now they are really synced. I'm going to check the same things. And oh, well, I was talking about money. And 300 rupees. <laughs> yep. I think they're going for the South Shore. They haven't been to uh, Mini Moldum Cave. Which has been kind of replaced, uh, it kind of replaced the Hype Cave during the, this tourney. Uh, lots of useful progression items. Well, it's kind of redundant, but really nice progression items in, uh, in Mini Moldum. Yeah, it's a, it's a Sphere 1 check, so it, it tends to have more items. And there's a Ooh. key cave for Bonta to know. He's probably just coming here to get some bombs, but found that as well. That's a good thing to know for later when he needs to buy bombs. Or not bombs, but buy keys. Yeah. And nice popos on a, in Mini Moldo Cave. It's a mini popo cave. <laughs> yeah, they, they kind of want a weapon. They've been using bombs pretty much this whole time. Oh, sick kid is now in magic. Another 20, another bottle. Shish and 300. Okay, so now both of them will have the rupees necessary to go to Zora. And I think he's going. To... Oh, okay, they won't skip Ice Red Cave. It has been a, a bit of a controversy in a <laughs> with a Scary Olive with another another play of this turn. He lost in the semi-finals against Highwreck uh, because Scary Olive never never goes to to Ice Red Cave. Oh, and a bush crab, a nice thinking for my way, but only pays with full magic, which is fine, but it doesn't need it right now. And the thinks. Yes, yeah, sorry. They just still checking for the sword cave. Well, I mean, we are in the miser, and they have been killing enemies with bombs for the last 12, 13 minutes, so. I'd be like them, you know. <laughs> I, I, I would want a sword right now. So, Relic's setting up a water walk here. He's probably gonna go to Zora. Yeah, even though they don't they don't have the uh, the Moon Pearl for the Waterfall Cave, I think it's interesting to do it right now. Uh, it's not in logic because they don't have the glove. Oh, and Bonta... They... Okay, no, they do have the flippers, my bad. Yeah, sorry, I, I, I just I forgot about that. Yeah, I, I had a brain fart, and it's like, Bonta just did a, a walk on water, but swam. <laughs> okay, so they're, they're both actually gonna go for... They're both coming up here to talk to the hobo first, which yeah. that's a good move. Do, do the water walk, because that makes it much quicker. Yes, and also because they have the flippers, uh, if they water walk and walk on shallow water, like the blue, the light blue one, uh, they will lose the walk on water, because they do have the flippers. So it's the good play to go to Hobo and then to Zoro, the Zoro's place. Uh, it's faster, actually. Uh, thank you, Arod, for the uh, the map with the shops in Retro. Oh, and Raiwek is going to check. Yeah. He's really good in retro. Like he, he has all the the reflexes to, to go uh, check all these caves and looking for that sword, a desperate sword they don't have right now. There are a lot of caves that can be in though, and at some point you just have to just stop looking in the caves if you don't find it. Well, while you're still swordless, I think it's it's a good time, you know. Yeah. To do it and release the bee, the golden bee for. Come on, be kind. Well, oh, <laughs> talking about that, the moon pearl was in Waterfall Cave, so they couldn't have gone there by a uh, uh, fake flipper or water walk. Now, so that's one piece to their dark world access. Yep, I didn't see what was on Zora's ledge. A key. A key. Oh, nice. Right, what does Zora have? For wow, like um, this is a what a uh, twelve percent interest something. <laughs> uh, that's really really bad. Just, like four percent uh, actually. It's, it's... Uh, yeah, it's really four percent. Wow. He's a good like he's a good businessman. 
Okay, so I just uh, asked a little bit about the 20 packs. Uh, they did make an update in a recent revision to the randomizer to add some 20 packs instead of the 5 packs for the arrows that are being replaced. So that's what we're seeing the green 20s for. Okay, I see. I see, I see. The bonds are going for Eastern Zone. Pyrex finding his third? Take any? Wow. Getting these extra hearts is nice for a Ryawak, especially early without a mail upgrade yet. I mean, I don't think these runners really need the hearts, but at the same time, it's Enemizer and you don't want to take the risk. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. And Ryawak finding his, uh, his arrow, because this is one of the most important things in Retro to. Um, you can have the bow, but you won't shoot any arrows unless you find that shop, that kind of shop. And shooting arrows actually just costs you money. Just like in, uh, I think, Zelda 2. I don't know if uh, in Zelda 1 it costs money too. Zelda 1. Okay. And meanwhile, Bonta found the Cane of Samaria, the, the red baguette in a. Uh, well, it's not a red baguette, it's like the red cane, the can in French. Yeah. <laughs> And yeah, Bont is heading into Eastern. I think this is logically our last spot to check right now. We don't have anything else yep. that's in logic. Absolutely. For, well, uh, Raiwek uh, didn't go to the escape. Yeah, Raiwek uh, did. Uh, yeah, yeah, like in no mode, Bonta has nothing. To, uh, there's nothing. Nowhere else to go. So there must be some progression. I'd bet on uh, maybe a glove to go to the mountain or a flute to go to the mountain. Flute would be more likely because glove doesn't give us mountain yep. access. Yeah, it just yeah. give us back of escape access. Uh, which is fine, you know. It's still three, three chests. Oh, that's not a nice. Now Eastern is not a nice dungeon in the miser because it's early on. There's so many. Weak enemies are everywhere. Hey! <laughs> the glove. What do you know? <laughs> so yeah, that would like so that opens up three items in the back of escape. And potentially Actually it might not even be three items, depending on what what it is. It could be as few as one item back there. Uh I think if uh, Bonta found the map in the first chest. Uh I was talking. I was going to talk about the compass, but the infamous <laughs> escape compass. No, there's no compass in escape, so I think it can. There can only be like two items in a key, maybe. That's possible. Yeah. That's it for in logic checks here. But Bonta's going to continue through the dark rooms to check one more chest. So it's largely possible. Actually, wait, it, yeah. It is an it is anemizer. Oh yeah, that's true. So they do have access to the boss. Well, they could it, like they can finish the dungeon. Well, they can't really finish the dungeon actually. I mean, they can't kill the boss. Yeah, you really can't unless it's like blind, which the king could do. Yep, and it it would be in logic actually. And the logic accounts for uh, for that. But no, actually, no, this is just Animizer, it's not Boss Miser. Oh, there's no it's Boss just Miser? just Animizer. I don't think so, yeah. Okay, well... I'm just gonna check, still, but yeah. They still could reach the boss in this situation, but yeah, with, if it's almost nice there, then... You're probably not killing it with your current loadout. <laughs> yeah, well, it's only Animizer, so it, it is the Armos Knights, and it's not going to be fun, and I don't think it's even possible for them. Yeah, I don't think it is. Uh, this is another the spot that opened. They got a bottle. Sick kid is open now. Ooh. <laughs> oh, jeez. What a fun seed. What now, a fun game. <laughs> that's not so bad in retro, actually. Because, yeah, true. Because of how the keys work, There's you got to remember that every key you're taking out is now an extra item check in a dungeon. So you could go into desert and check three spots right away. Actually, you can check everything except the boss because yep. you don't have you have no way to get to the boss right now. Yeah, exactly. So it's actually, like uh, right now, it would be four checks in a in a dungeon, uh, five, and plus one on the mountain. And Bonta is going straight to the mountains, and Raiwek doesn't want to go away 
from his progression. Yeah, I, I like Bryx move better because like Bonta's gotta know there's something in the back of his game. Because he knows this is his only spot in logic. And a key twenty Oh nothing. No wait, sorry, we got so that book. Is... That yeah, yeah, yeah. So it is the book. book. Progression is the book. And the old man Gary has the mitts. Okay, so that is or the the moufle, as we we some people like to call him in French, the moufle. Yeah. <laughs> that is dark world progression, but yep. it is out of logic right now. <laughs> so it's largely uh, possible the the lamp is in a is in desert. Lamp or so the I, Actually, no, it has to be the lamp. You're right, because... Yeah, it has to be the lamp. The lamp to get... I'm actually a little surprised Bonta maybe didn't at least go check that ether tablet. I guess it is a little extra time. I know Bonta doesn't like to do extra checks like that, so... Well, that because uh, I think... He has to go back to, to Tower of Era because it's... Well, first of all, it's a crystal, and it's also uh, a red crystal. And right now he, he cannot go, well, he can go in the Tower of Hera, but he can't kill uh, Molson because he has no sword or hammer. So I think it's logical for him to go there, how we're getting his mitts at the same time. Yeah, that, that does make sense. You gotta come back up oh. anyway, so... Highwick well... with a very, very convoluted way to get blocked by the, uh, the dead rock, with a, <laughs> a block of Samaria. Uh, what is oh that's kind of, it's kind of nice actually for a back of escape in the miser. Just that one in me. Yeah, I didn't I even also... notice it. Sorry, I, for... I forgot also that since it is retro here, there is going to be an item in Dark Cross. Oh, that's true. So Iwak is going to check the book and also maybe do a Dark World map check so we will know what we need in this seed. Maybe. No, it doesn't care. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, we're, only, we're only looking for one more pendant because Rowick did talk to uh, Saharsla and found out that Meyer is a pendant. Oh. Actually, Rowick doesn't have the book. It doesn't but... have the book. Wow. Now, funny, it goes to well. If you find the, if you find the sword, it's uh, it's good progression, and you can do the dungeon. I mean, a sword, a hammer. Yeah, something in well, only sword or hammer actually for Molto. I mean, if you were to find something here, that could be an advantage over Bonta. Yep, but Bonta is going well. Really, like, I won't say <laughs> vanilla way, but it's oh, I would good. Not grab bad. By the hand. <laughs> Cost you a few seconds, but that's not the worst place to get grabbed. <laughs> yep. And just a map in that room for Bonta. Highwick. Oh, with the wrong. Uh... Yep. Yeah. <laughs> the switch is need to be blue. Needs to be blue. Now, actually, Skull Woods in, in Retro is a good play because you're taking three keys out of here. That means there's five items in this dungeon. And there's also a bunch of keys lying on the ground, so you can get a few of them. Nice heart refill for Bonta. <sighs> I work in a tricky spot with the Pocky and the floating head. They these do a lot of damage. Oh, the Pocky is in that place in Tower of This is really bad. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You yeah. Guys well done. Over on Bonta's side, hasn't found much in Skull Woods yet. Yeah, it's just only money. Maybe come to curse. No, ten bombs. <laughs> uh, we found the the compass. Any mirrors? Mirrors out. I think it was seven quid. And Bonta with the hover to go to the big chest of Skull Woods. Doesn't really pay off, but still, lots of swag. Such a complicated trick to do. So I think at this point, I'm guessing Bonta has just written off that there's a lamp in desert. We we'll have to keep that in in our minds for later, just knowing there is something in desert. I'm 
He's doing north checks first. You can check graveyard ledge. If he wants, he can go on to catfish. Yeah, really, like many, many things to do. Uh, but no dungeon wise. Nothing dungeon wise. Oh, nice yeah. bomb. Ooh. That was tricky. And another 20 for Bonta. And I'm like just following his, his, his opponent tonight. Well, tonight here in France. Not tonight, maybe in uh, <laughs> in America for you. Yeah, it's. Uh... Oh, there's our map check. Oh, we yeah. We have a pendant at Turtle Rock, and we also have a red crystal at Thieves Town. Yep. So, Fire Rod, Ice Rod. A bow, hook shots, the medallions, yeah, many many items come <laughs> to finish the seed. Well, I mean the actually the nice thing about the seed with pendants being on Meyer and Turtle Rock, medallions aren't necessarily required. Oh sorry, Meda uh, pendant on Turtle Rock. So yeah, no ice run actually. That's nice. No ice run and on the finals. How neat. Well, in before uh, something on a on a pet, but <laughs> oh well, oh well. <laughs> and I work with a nice bomb in that niche little room with the full refill of magic. And Monta in the middle of uh, what I would describe as a war zone. <laughs> with so many enemies shooting, so many projectiles everywhere. Like, this is like a Stanley Kubrick film. This Ooh. is horrendous. Yeah, yeah, even takes a death. <laughs> and this is kind of where those hearts that Ryway picked up might come into play a little bit. <laughs> yeah, possibly, yeah. Ooh, Bonta with a really tight space uh, between a minimal dome and a, and a, and a, and a path. And a small key. Yeah, how weird these enemies that are, you know, a bit on a, on the upper um, layer of the of the dungeon. They can touch you sometimes. It's kind of weird, kind of wonky. The fire bar was at the perfect place for Bonta to go. And the fourth chest in the front of Thief Town. Yeah. And I work with a really, really nice bomb jump without a sword. It's really tricky, actually. Yeah, where it works out, and when Bonta's out of Thieves Town, makes sense, you don't have a hammer, you don't have a wood, you actually don't have... Well, you can kill blind with the King yep. of Samaria, but... Yeah, without the hammer, you kind of just want to wait in the back for now. Thieves Town is actually, yeah, it's actually in logic. Uh, the game could expect you to go a bit blind for your hammer. That oh, is well. a possibility. <laughs> That would be really, really awful, <laughs> but it could but, happen. Also, in retro, though, you know you've got access to the Thieves Town big chest, so yep. that's not something you necessarily want to deal with. <laughs> and a digging game. I want uh, I just a tiny bit behind his uh, his opponent. But Bonta having checked. Uh, I don't know, Ryuk, did Ryuk do the, the front of escape? No, Ryuk has not done the front of escape. Yeah, okay, so... Ryuk a bit behind and with a, a tiny... Uh, a fewer checks. Not less checks, but fewer checks. Should I speak good English? <laughs> yeah, the big difference between these two has been Ryuk's been looking for those take any caves. Trying to find that sword. Bata has basically ignored them. Well, for the best for the best of him, because uh, right now he didn't find. Ryuk is soulless. Thirty minutes in this seed. Bonta is too. It's kind of bad. Yes. <laughs> so far, the sword is not coming to play, and so Bonta's got the advantage because of that. Now, if Ryuk finds that sword, that can change. Oh yes, many many things. Well, first of all, it could uh, it could allow him to to do some um, some item dash. Because it won't work if you don't have a sword. Ah, uh, just a key for 10 rupees. Which is nice, but... It's not what he's you want. 
He's have been generous in this. Oh, scene. very very generous. They don't have lots of money, so it's actually nice with them. And Bonta going for the classic uh, Smith chain with the uh, with the uh, the chest going to keep forty five and Stumpy like a tiny bit of a, a voyage <laughs> with the chest. Yeah. That's, um, to run, okay. Run a little low on checks. Wait, wow. the, oh, there's a the fire rod. <laughs> the red baguette. Here it is. Uh, it opens actually just the back of Scobus, so it's just two more checks. Well, actually, that's good because that also means you can do all of deserts. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, now desert is an object. Unfortunately, it's a pendant. <laughs> oh, well. The red baguette, yeah, of course. Well, it's actually in French, it would be uh, baguette de feu. It's literally the, the baguette. <laughs> I'm not even like being uh, not uh, insensitive <laughs> with my own people. Now I got some divergence here. Royal fit going, going through Thieves Town that Bont is leaving behind. Yep. And some hype gay for Bont, uh, but yeah, Highwick just wants to finish Thieves Town. It's a crystal. It's understandable. It's red crystal, actually. Uh, this one. Oh. Bleh. Yeah. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> Meh of a 10. Meh out of 10. Yeah, I mean, you'll take the, the blue male anonymizer, and the mushroom at least gives you a check, but yeah, that's Meh. not really that <laughs> And I think Bonta's gonna take this, and I think he's gonna go to deserts via the Bombos tablet, so we can check that. Yeah, always, always check. Oh, that's right. He, he's also yeah, he has the purple chest. <laughs> well, you don't see the chest. That's normal. But <laughs> I saw him pick it up. I forgot he left it behind. Yeah, that's well. Yeah, so the game doesn't really register if you have the chest or not. Uh, it's kind of weird, kind of wonky. But basically how the game works. Uh, but yeah, Bonsa really just you check Bombos tablet when you're here and it's just 20 rupees. And it goes to desert, so that's a really, really neat bit of routing he did it there. That's really clever. And so, they could well be the hammer in a in a in desert. And you've got three items in here you can get. While Rawek is going to do a cane Sam a Samaria blind. <laughs> uh, it's always fun. I think it's like the nicest way to do blind. And it goes to the second phase. Well, it's going really well for us so far. Now we do expect to find the lamp here in deserts. Yup. Which would... Um... Put the mountain in logic and everything both of these players have done so far. Lines down, just 20 rupees, but Rawak gets the first crystal. Nice. So he's officially in front of Bonta for the moment. Really, really neat fights, what Rawak did. It's not easy to do, especially like with a green mail and no shield. And he's going to do, I think, the same things that Bonta did would be would be logical. So with the mitts, you first do. Oh, he wants to farm some money and the lamp, as you called it. It's logical. Actually, you pretty much called that earlier. Well, yeah, but I, I, I want to share the uh, <laughs> the love, you know. Yeah. Oh, there's some half magic. Though. You'll take that too. Oh, oh, you really, really take that. Especially in the sea with uh, no sword and no hammer, so all of your weapons are magical. Yeah, double double shots for your fire rod at this point. And there the compass. Is, there is an item on land molas because of that. Yep, I think Monte is going to go there. Oh, and also, yeah, you can kill land molas so easy on right now with the with the half magic. How fun! Now, even if he, all he comes out of here is with the lamp, it's, that's a pretty good find. It's a pretty good thing to pick up an animizer because 
you just don't want to deal with dark rooms in Animizer. You really don't. <laughs> oh, you um, really, really don't. So, you know, he might just take that. The next stop might be Pod, for example. A pod without the hammer and the bow <laughs> would be a bold move. Well, without the bow in Animizer, it's not so bad. You can, you, you can just know you're going to be able to... Actually, Pod is a is a treasure trove in, in, my, in, a, in retro, actually. Because since you're taking six keys out of the pool in Pod, that means you've got a Pod that has 11 items, potentially. You cannot put that off too long. Yep. Okay, seeing, seeing it like this, it's, uh, it's rather logical. And actually, yeah, between retro and Animizer, it's all in logic except for the boss. Um, is it now? Oh, yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, there are no keys in the dungeon, of course. And Bonta with the Amo Amos <laughs> in his uh, in his rooms, actually taking care of these enemies and finding the keys, very very useful keys. And I think we're going to see a very clean and quick Lenmonas fight with the uh, with the fire rod. Oh yeah, um, fire rod Lenmonas is really easy. <laughs> Yeah, it's just two hits because uh, the fire does uh, butter to damage. So it's really, really quick. Boom, 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 boom. Ah! <laughs> it short hopped. Ah! <laughs> oh, sad. <laughs> oh well, that's the commentator curse for you. And the pendant. Meanwhile, Raiwek is going is getting mugged by a, a thief with all its bombs. He's getting bounced off everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, he even throws fish. Like, he's really, really young. <laughs> I think he's, he's had enough, you know? So, yeah, Bonta got uh, lamp and half magic out of that desert. He'll definitely take the lamp, but it's not really anything too exciting beyond that. It's, it's safeties for the seed, it's nice stuff to pick up, but it's not really progression per se. Yep. And even though Raiwick has uh, one more dungeon done, it's not exactly in front of his uh, of his burner right now. The thing is, Raiwick cannot go into desert. He did not grab that book. He has not checked Sick Kid. <laughs> oh yeah, it's true. Uh, what, a tricky place, what a tricky place of the book. Uh, for the book to have progression to. Ooh, Raiwick, well, checking the first two chests of Swamp. Yep, that's because right. Because it doesn't have the armor. Yeah, there are two checks in here because it's uh, because of it being retro. Bonds had turned in the mushroom. It was nothing. He reset. Uh, classic play. So we'll see because Swamp could be a really big coup for for Iwek. And Bonta, where are you? Is he going to Ice Palace? Possibly? Yeah, well, ice... It's just a few items too, a few checks. Uh, and I think he's going for it. Yeah, he's going to Ice Palace. <laughs> wow. Well, Raiwek is known among the French community to really, really like Ice Palace. And... Uh, um, so, Bonta may know that his opponent does that a lot, going to Ice Palace. So maybe it's some meta play there? Could it's be. also maybe just a... Uh... Well, he has the, the Samaria, so it's not like big time investment for him to go there. Yeah, with the... Um, I believe with the new trick, with the... Um, well, the newish trick now, it's been around yeah, yeah. a little bit. <laughs> um, you can get uh, like the, uh, the Icebreaker. Yeah, you can get everything but I think two chests, maybe three, depending on where the big key is. Well, right now, without a uh, without hammer, they can, he can only check uh, three chests, if my memory serves me correctly. Um, you can't check Cold Stair, you can't check the room in the, in the, you can't, you can't check the room with the pegs. Yep, you cannot check the room with the stairs, because you need, in no, the room can. with the pegs. You can check this room if you if you see it's not in logic, but you can check it. 
Ah oh, yeah, true. Um, so and Bonte again, <laughs> really <laughs> bodied with it. Oh, the Lino. Uh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh. The Lino said, "No, nah, I don't want you going in here." Oh, I work with the nice, yeah, the nice fairy cave. Good thinking. Doesn't pay off. Reminder that both of these players are swordless uh, right now, and it's not a swordless seed. So there are actually four swords waiting for them in this seed, and they didn't find any of them for now. The yeah, Banta specifically vetoed swordless. Yep, and Raiwick did only one swordless seed, and it was. Well, it was a doozy, of course. This is swordless. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> swordless can be less fun than expected. Oh, Raiwick filling another key and uh, arrow shop. Oh, Bonta with one heart, almost dying in the middle of Ice Palace. There's a heart under this part. And Raiwek, uh, why are you going? Is he going to, he's going to pod. He heard you. Yeah, he's going for the treasure trouble pod. Nice thinking. This no. ice palace. Oh, he's gonna wow. blow this potion. <laughs> yeah, I, I, <laughs> I think even Bonta said, "Wow, I, I really need the potion right now." <laughs> yeah, that's kind of a okay. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> yep, I know my limits now. <laughs> Don't do that. An ice tea room, and I think does he has does he have access to he... the 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 freezer room? He does. Yes. There's a nice little yeah, bomb yeah, well, that you can yeah, do. Yeah, a small bomb jump that's uh, absolutely free if you know the setup. It literally is free. You just jam yourself in the corner and play, place the bomb. That's it. <laughs> yep. Well, it's absolutely free then. <laughs> and uh, does it pay off? No. The compass. And Raiwek finding nothing in the pyramid. He's going to do the front of escape, maybe. Oh, he's going to see Uncle at 42 minutes. Wow. Yeah. And Ice was a bust without the hammer. And Bonta is going for... Uh, he's going Tower to go for Hera now. Which yep. is going to give Ryuk some time to catch up because we know Bonta's not going to find anything here. Yep. Exactly. So, uh, how the, interesting. The only new thing we might get is a check of Ether Tablets. And that's it. And I think you are right in saying that Pod has the answer. I think we are not going to find any progression while uh, both it's, of these players are not going there. It's Pod or Catfish? Oh yeah, there's Catfish too, of course, there's Catfish. <laughs> there's Catch Cash, wow. 20 rupees on both tablets. Thank you, book. <laughs> Thank you for your service. I mean, the book gets you to the lamp, so that's its logic. But yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's not the greatest. Oh, there's some hands in the in these dark rooms. <laughs> oh, where is Ryvik? I know he's in the dark room, but what dark room is he? It's the first dark room of plot or of uh, Pyro Castle. Oh wow. Oh yeah, true. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's actually not that bad. Oh, sorry, right. he has fire rod. This is not that bad with fire rod. <laughs> oh, and we are in advanced um, advanced mode. Uh, advanced setting, sorry. So, uh, it's in logic with the fire rod. Now, this is a check that Rawat did not make as well. He did not come down here because he didn't have a fire source at the time. Ah. Uh, and Bonta, so in the French community, when you lodge yourself on these, um, what, that blue thing in the, in the basement of Era, we call that the pose Rawat, so the Rawat pose. So because you you while while you are on this position you are invincible and you need not to touch your your teapad, so you can go make yourself a coffee or tea, or pour yourself some coffee and some tea because it's not that <laughs> that long. Okay, that's a cat. <laughs> yeah, I pet the kitty. Exactly. All right, if there's some down here, it's it's a big advantage to Bonta. Nope. Nope. Uh, nope. <laughs> So, Bot or Catfish? 
are going to be our progression location. Oh, how nice of the, the Popo to go up for Bonta. And Bonta actually doing the same mistake as Rayweck for some reason. It's it's just muscle memory. You, your muscle memory gets off in Animizer because you're on the same enemies and it just it just throws you off at times. Just a reminder, this is game one of a three game set. Game two will follow right after this, and game three, if necessary, will be tomorrow. Yep, tomorrow at uh, 3.10, so it's uh, well, it's 3 10 p uh, 3.10 p.m. There's no need to translate in, in French uh, or European times here. <laughs> I know most of the, the audience is, uh, is from the U.S. But it's a big deal in, uh, in, uh, in the French stream because we have uh, both, uh, both um, nationalities. Yeah, that is very fair. Oh, yes. I'm very hyped. All right, and it's a good match Ra for now. Rywak is going to pod, and he is going. I, I think wonder Bonta's, what Bonta is. Yeah, Bonta's probably going there doing. too, but he's got this. This is his only portal to go there. Like this is oh, yeah, true. this is your only access to Dark World right now. Are oh, you just checking the caves? Maybe finally finding his sword. So desperately looking for it for like 46 minutes now. There and he finally <laughs> gets it! Wow! <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> and Rywick with a sword going to pod with hopefully some progression for him. And maybe Bond tagging some progression too, uh, going to catfish at the same time. So I'm pretty sure Bont is never going to find that sword. That's, That's a huge advantage for Warwick for right now. <laughs> That's really, really possible, actually. And Kiki, the monkey. Ooh, opening up. Ooh, the Motodactyl. Oh, that's really nasty. And yeah, Ooh. it trolls Raiwek and he may troll Bonta later on because he won't have the sword. Oh. oh! Well, now... <laughs> that could be the progression. Um... That could be... Well, be, well... Yeah, it's actually uh, Mr. Mario's own axis. By the way, that kind of fully invalidates that book. <laughs> well, not fully. True? Logically, you still didn't need to get it, but... I, I don't think Ryo will ever need to use it. <laughs> yep. And uh, so it's actually, well, it's it's a uh, quality of life to, to have the lamp, but it's really not necessary for these players. Uh, remember, that this is a final, so they are not beginners. Now, here's something to watch if Fanta does decide to depot next. He only has three keys. Rywek had 11 coming in, down to 10 now. Yeah, true. Uh, that means Banta, unless he gets some keys in pod, won't be able to full clear it. Uh, 10 of September, uh, I think there is actually no logic concerning the rupees. Uh, I think you are expected to be able to farm the enemies and find some rupees. That's correct. There is no logic in regards to rupees. Ex in the same way with bombs, actually, and uh, other collectibles. Pretty much, yeah. The game expects you to always be able to collect rupees or bombs. Now, and sometimes could... it can be really, really tricky. Yeah. There are times when you might have to buy something off Zora and there's only, like, say, 100 rupees available in the pool before then. And then you don't have a glove to get the easy farm spot. Yep. But technically, you can find one rupee in a, in a bush and do that 500 times. And there you go. <laughs> Ooh, that's a nasty, nasty little room with the, uh, the beetles and the thief. The right way going through, and he has to use his mirror now. He doesn't have the armor. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, yep. I think he, he forgot about that for a second. Yeah, yeah. 
Well, it's the finals. They know he's being restreamed. There's a bunch of uh, anxiety, a little bit of stress going in. So it's all uh, it's all forgiven. <laughs> oh yeah, Bonta actually going to pot with mm, well next to no keys compared to Ryweck, so could make the difference, especially if there's some progression in the back. The other thing is, Bonta has the lamp, Rarick doesn't, so Rarick's going to have some difficult dark moves coming up here. And there's just another casual hand hover by Bonta. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true, he can do that. And Rarick actually setting up the bomb jump, the hammer jump. Yeah, a lot of runners prefer this, especially when they have to deal with dark rooms, because it's just Neat. a little faster. Really, really, really well done. And now, the Dark Maze in the dark. And that's going to be way, way harder for Highway compared to Bonta, because it, Bonta has the lamp. Oh. At least... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, wow. this is where the hammer jump is going to come in even more handy than a Rywick. <laughs> nice. Well, uh, what a nice room. And oh, I want... Man. The roller, yeah. The roller and the chomp, the chomps are really bad. Monta not farming the five rupees in that room. Just coming through. Our... Is Monta going to the harmless hallway or the dark maze? Is going for the harmless hallway. So if I found something, That's find not something a there. Hallway. Well. I... <laughs> <laughs> it certainly isn't now, with the uh, two chumps, but... <laughs> yeah, let's call it the hellway now. The animizer hellway. Oh yeah, true, well, of course you can hover or bomb jump. Well, how am I jump? So, it didn't really, it didn't really need to, to choose between the two. I think Rara got lost in the Stark maze. Yeah, it's possible because uh, when you don't see, oh, when Bonta actually having next to non HP, he's got to bomb jump this. He has no keys left. Whoa! <laughs> and the hammer in the dark maze, ladies and gentlemen. Wow! And Bonta might die actually in that maze. Now he's got the lamp. He'll be fine. <laughs> I probably be fine, but that is some progression. So he's taking this very carefully. Oh yes. Why? Right. Yeah, yeah, and he's going to get it. Uh, slight two, three second pose now for Bonta, <laughs> just trying to to process what just happened to him. And he found the hammer, and he's gone. So now, what is he going to do? Fifth stone, maybe? Yeah, he's... So without the bow, he definitely can't finish that now anyway. Though he could have elected to dip to mirror and go to eastern finish that well hmm. he could have it wouldn't it, it was possible now but wouldn't have been nice oh yeah most certainly wouldn't have been nice oh i think actually oh yeah are we going away because he doesn't have the bow to kill helmets of king and oh seven i think rogue's not Mirroring back to Lightwood or anything, I think this is going to be a play to catfish for Rarok, which would be good because it'll get him his flute. And we're starting to look like Meyer might be our next, the Meyer area at least, might be our next big spot. Yeah, yeah, it's going to be the next big coup for I, them. Actually, no, no, I'm, I'm wrong. Eastern Death Mountain. That just all opened up. Oh yes, be with the hammer and the mirror, and that's exactly what Bonta is going to do, go do. Now Bonta's... getting his flutes. Yeah, he's still swordless though. Yeah, that's bad, huh? We have not seen a sword in the actual pool yet. We've seen yeah. one take any cave with the sword. That's it. Yeah, that's true. And you know what? This is a really, really fun seat to watch because this is the finals i'm hyped chat is hyped and it's just a retro animizer seed it's not that big of a deal in terms of logic and yet 55 minutes in no swords for bonta i'm pretty sure at this point bonta's sitting there saying 
I vetoed swordless. Why do I not have a sword? <laughs> That's true. How, how ironic. Oh, and the, uh, the eye go. Oh, and the liner. Wow. Nice hype cave. Uh, not hype cave. Uh, sparrow cave. There's most certainly no hype with all of these enemies around. Yeah, without that sword, this is uh, definitely yeah. a little uglier. Oh, yeah. <laughs> much, much uglier. Yeah. But maybe this is hype. We'll see right now. Nah. I think it's vanilla. Ryuk is going to get his flute here. It's a Karina. Yay. He's going to go to the statue and let us hear the Ocari National Anthem, as we call it in French, uh, in the French stream. Ponta with the dark East Death Mountain. Actually, just the East, East Mountain. Uh, okay. That's true, we didn't go there before. Yep, got both sides. There's a lot of checks up here. And knowing that uh, Bonte has no problem covering, he can check even all of uh, Hookshot Cave. Oh, yeah, that's true. Could be a big coup for him. And just Brooks. one key. Ah, I like he's going to lose some time maybe finding his, his book. I don't think so. At this point, I don't think he's going to go out of his way to check the tablets, and he's got his desert access anyway. So yeah, he, that's he, true. He, know, he probably knows at this point that Desert has something, and probably his lamp. If he's paying attention to the logic, he'll know Desert has the lamp. Bonta, without a sword, has to hammer the Moldorm. There oh, he goes. Well. <laughs> Finally, the first soul for Bonta, 56 minutes. Jeez. <laughs> Where actually where is Rowick going? Oh, he's gonna do Skull Woods right now. Okay, that makes sense. Well, yeah, with the fire rod and now uh, his sword, it's going to be way way easier for him. And he can actually to be easy. A, he can actually loop in a pet check while he's here too. Yeah, that's true actually, and Bontat didn't do that beforehand, so we may well have a pet check in this finals. How fun it would be to have a pet seed! <laughs> Praise! <laughs> and 20 rupees, okay. Once I'm not finding anything useful right now, it may change in the hookshot cave. Right now, we need a bow and a hookshot. I think that's it. Uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking you're right. We need the bow for pod and swamp. We need uh, the hookshot for... Uh, well, you, you we got need, me, yeah. We need the bow for pod, the, the hookshot for swamp. Yeah, exactly. And, ooh, Montel going for the long, long hover in hookshot cave. So you won't find the hookshot here, you might find the bow. And he has to have this to... This can be tricky in Enemies when you try to do these, these hovers, but the enemies in here wow. are kind of nice. Wow, and a sword to... to help you now. That's... Oh, and Raiwick with a very fantastic quick kill on Moth. Getting his compass, but also his second crystal. So the Master yes. Sword in Hookshot Cave was a big, big find for Bonta. I don't think those swords will work for long, but at the same time, that's a good thing for Bonta to find, get to those swords to finish. He doesn't have a crystal in nearly an hour, so that's just a little weird. Yep. But, not, you know, the way the seats played out is not necessarily bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not like really doing anything wrong, it's just a seat that's uh, rather trolley. Uh, 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 yes, the blue switch. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> oh, oh, and okay. the bow. There's a there's mm. one of the items we need. Yep. Uh, I think we'll need to find actually another sword uh, because you cannot go a uh, bit Ganon with just a fighter sword. And a pet check. Come on, come on. Nope. <laughs> huh? 
What is that? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. We are in retro. It's like, well, this is not Key Sanity. How did you find a key? We are in retro. Yeah. And Marek's going to take that bow. He's going to do Eastern Pod back to back. <laughs> and that bow uh, should is... not... Oh, go ahead. I was just going to say, that bow should not elude Bonta for too long. Yup, and uh, seven eyed Muldorm. Oh, he misses the third spin and he gets it. Nicely, nicely done. We'll get his first crystal and it's a red crystal for Bonta with his 50 rupees. Alright, we're getting back to Pod, finishing, I think, both the Eastern and Pod at the same time, of course. Yep, it's just Chris. a sword. Third and fourth crystals. Hera, he can probably go. He'll probably do Hera when he goes up to check all those items shortly. And actually, Box is gonna go finish ice. Yeah, it's true. It's I, right now. Um, I think they have many, many dungeons to do, and it's going to be no other, no other world than just going to the dungeons. Especially like that, we found the bow in Skullwoods. So Bonta is going to go there eventually and find a bow, and it will lead him to Pod in this time. Now this is going to be a little tricky for Ryuk. He's got to do some minimizer dark rooms. Oh yes, and that dark room with the six turtles is not fun, even when it's the turtles. But with the minimizer, it could be way worse. He does have fire rod leaves for that room, but he's got to get to. He's got to get in position to light that torch. So I'm eager to see how Rewek is going to do in that room. And Bonta, oh my lord, what a, what a room <laughs> with two firebars and a Lionel uh, hovering uh, like back to uh, on the ice. It's <laughs> such a bad room he's, in Ice Palace. He's going to try to get through this again. <laughs> oh yeah, look at this. Wow. Yeah, with the Master Sword right now, he can hurt him and actually push him out of the way. So it's easier for him. Good for him. Oh, these are nasty little enemies. But with the fire rod, and that's a neat technique. He gets he gets the splash damage actually. And yeah, I think he was trying to light the torch and well, couldn't get it. But he it killed worked, the huh? <laughs> It actually works. So if it's stupid, where well, it works, it ain't stupid. <laughs> yep. And Monta, oh, Monta actually not getting too troll here. Gonna be key. Ryuk. Oh, this is not going to be a fun fight for Ryuk with only the fighter sword. He's got arrows for phase two, though. His oh, rupee count. Yeah, yeah, rupee count is not really that high. 137. Uh, it's 10 rupees for an arrow, so. And he's got an armor fight coming up. Yep. So I don't think he's going to go waste too too much here. I don't know where he is pushing wise, but he's actually going for the hammer kill and it gets it really, really nice. Highway gains third crystal, if I'm not mistaken. It finds the map. Third crystal for him. <laughs> nice. That Ruby Cow's gonna be interesting for Armos. He's gonna have to do some shots without the bow. Now, of course, it's worth remembering that you don't need the bow to actually beat Armos. So he's fine for actually killing them. He's just going to be a little slower. We got Banta taking on Cole's tear. Ooh, did not get the group club scooped up in the corner, so it's going to be a bit longer of a fight for him. He uses up what he does have in the fire rod. And now it's mostly spins, and he cannot. He's got to be very careful. If that puff hit, that puff hits him, he's dead. <laughs> and if anything hits him, he's dead. <laughs> he's taking this very carefully. That puff is getting close, down with a half heart. <laughs> and there's the hook shot. 
We are in no mode. So for these runners, Rywick needs to go to Ice Palace to get the hook shot. He also needs to get the swords off of Death Mountain. Bonta needs to go to Skull Woods and get the bow. And that's exactly where Bonta's going. He's going to Skull Woods. He's about to hit go mode. And how, like, 15 minutes ago, we were just complaining about the fact that they, he doesn't have enough a sword. And now he's just going to go go mode. <laughs> Run, that's Rondo for you. Now, Bonta's a little behind on dungeons as well. But, so, rorik has got a chance here. He needs to go to Ice Palace basically right after Easter. And as I've told you, um, he has a... Um, he's known to love Ice Palace and do it, so... I think he may well do that. Now, Rorik did pick up a good amount of rupees on the way here, so... He does have plenty of arrows now for Armos Knights. Yep. Uh, so it's a very expensive fight, which is rare. <laughs> That's neat. Well done. He's down to... well, he has nine arrows now. He's taking his flute, and I think... Maybe flute eight and go to ice would be fine. If he, if he flutes to eight, I think it's advantage him for this race. If he goes up Death Mountain, it's not terrible, but he's gonna be running out of time quick. He's fluting the eight. Ooh, let's go! Ryuk going to Ice Palace, finding his hook shot and his go mode in the next few minutes. Oh, he won't be we in have go a race! Quite yet, but it, he'll assume he's basically in go mode at that point. As long yeah, as he, he has a fight. He needs a sword, yes. That's true, but. I think he's going to assume that uh, there's some swords on the on the way. Bata is in go mode himself. He has picked up his fire rod. Mm -hmm. So now uh, this is this just will be, <laughs> this will be Bata's third crystal. Uh, yes, and that's uh, you know it's not even a boss rush now. It's just a dungeon rush. He uh, just has the go mode. He had the gummit outside of the dungeons, you know. So we're going to go to see him go to Far this Eastern is... Swamp and Skullwood. That is kind of messy in that ice room. That's not a nice ice room, actually, yes. <laughs> and with only Quake, uh, there's no easy way to get rid of all of these enemies. Oh, the sword was in a paradox, yes, but paradox cave in a light world, so... Ah, yeah, maybe, you know? Maybe Highwick will where? find both of the swords in the, in the mountain. Okay, yeah, I was, I was asking where Bata's gonna go, but he's going back, he's, gonna go, he's going to Thieves Town. Yeah. And so we, there won't be any uh, Pyramid Fairy check, even though it was, you know, very early on in uh, in uh, in logic, and Raiwe getting trolled in the same way as Bonta did before by the Lionel, and funny going through. And now Raiwe will gain some time because he has the hammer and he's single dipping ice and a neat little icebreaker from him. Now, at, th at this point, I do expect Bonta to basically not check anything else. Rywek, though, still has to ke keep checking chests. He needs a sword. So he will be doing some extra checks that will cost him a little bit of time. At the same time, though, you might find that fourth sword sitting somewhere out there. Yeah, possibly in GT. Way possibly in GT. Huh. And now this is just, you know, uh, we're just expecting them to have seven crystals and see where the race is going. Uh, 
like I'm, we know what chests they are going to they're going to open. So I'm just, I'm just waiting. <laughs> Both of these players competing in the finals of this French tourney, the French, the French community, well, the French-speaking community, uh, this tournoi francophone, as you can see uh, at the bottom of your screen right now. My work is Canadian, actually. So just to kind of cover quick oh. what game Hello. two is going to look like. Are you still there, sir? <laughs> Uh, just to cover what game two is going to look like quick. Um, in game two, uh, basically whoever loses this will get uh, the opportunity to I'm... veto. Whoever Am I alone? The opportunity... Just not hearing him. <laughs> Trying to hear you, JP. Oh, right, wait, don't go down there without the uh, the chest. So, as I was saying, for game two, um, there will be a mode selection. So, basically, uh, whoever loses will get to veto, whoever wins will veto one. Um, and then the, the loser will also get to choose two modes, while the winner gets to choose one. So that's just kind of an idea of what's going on for game two, when we get there. So, Bata takes down Blind, Rywick wants to take on Cold Stare. Rywick does have to be careful with his shots here. He, yeah, he will have no extra fire rod shots. And he's still on Fighter Sword, so he's going to pull out a hammer for this fight. Yeah, with the blue mail, he needs to actually be a bit more careful right now. He's bleeding hearts everywhere. Neat kill on that puff in the corner, but... Ooh, he almost had them, but oh. yeah, oh, this is tricky. Well, he has a blue and he has no. Nope. Oh, he has a blue potion. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <So>, okay. Yeah. <laughs> that gives him some fire rod shots to work with too. <laughs> yeah, better save than sorry. You don't want to go back there. And Ryweg, one hour, twelve minutes in, gets his hook shot and his go mode. Technically go mode. He will need to find a sword, but yeah. So they are both. Well, Rogue's got his five crystals, Bonta's got four. The swamp and the Tower of Hera for Highwick, and Swamp Pod in Eastern for Bonta. It's kind of... It's really close, huh? This is really Not close. A... I I don't know which way this is going to go. I'd say Rogue's going to get to GT first, but... Beyond that, I can't say much more. Uh, the only difference is going to be if either runner goes for Swamp Go mode or not. Will they open some chests on the way one day? I don't think Bonta will. Rywip probably will still open some. Uh, we'll see right there. Does Bonta stop? No, he goes for it. Yeah, it's... It's kind of expected from him. From him. Sorry. He uh, doesn't. Kind he, of. he really doesn't care about doing Master Sword Sorkless. But he knows that um, it would be way easier and way quicker to do it with one more sword, but uh, full clearing swamp is really, really long. Yeah. Like, the only chests he might check are the chests in. Um, the two chests in the the sunken room, and then maybe the one chest in the waterfall room. Yeah, these chests are really, really convenient, and uh, they both have the uh, Samaria cane, so the um, the dive down trick is going to be easy for them, because I know both of these players find it easier to do it with the cane instead of the bomb. And an Enemizer, depending on what you get down here, this can be a very tricky setup, actually. But this seems to be fine. The powder... It's kind of nice, actually. Bit of safety. I don't know why he got his... Oh, he already got his hookshot for the boss. Okay. That's, like, really... <laughs> 
Red preparation from Bonta. Gets the map. No, well, let's see what Warwick's strategy is going to be. Yeah, I think he's going for go mode. Huh? I don't think he's going to go left side. He knows. Ah, okay. He's actually going down there. So maybe he's full clearing Swan. I don't think he's full clearing, but this is a quick check chest to get to, and he's got a little more motivation to go down here. Oh, the. <laughs> That was... Ah, Berna. That's I don't bad, know now. That's not a bad pick up an Enemizer. Because you don't yeah, know true. what you're getting in GT. Yeah, true, true, true. Uh, Enemizer can be really, really tricky in the uh, in the gauntlet. That's true, I didn't think of that. So uh, maybe a good find. The, the torch room with the fire bar can be bad. <laughs> depending on what oh, you yes. get in there. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> A nice diver down from both Bonta and Hayek in this uh, in this dungeon, and Bonta actually getting a, a long cycle. Is like the fire rod did way less damage than usual, didn't it? Or am I well, crazy? I'm not, I'm not fully sure on that one. Oh, we're always gonna have a bit of a longer fight because he's only got the fighter sword. Oh yes, yeah, true. He may well. Well, no. It's even. F it's always faster to use uh, even the fighter sword instead of the hammer. This maneuvering is really, yeah. really long. I think the biggest difference is he can only get one puff at a time. I don't. I wasn't fully watching Bonta. He might have been doing two. Ah, uh, Bonta did two. Yes, most of the time. Yeah, this is a tricky fight, especially like. You know, you're in go mode, you're in the finals, you're one hour in, you want to go fast, you want to go fast. And this is really, really frustrating to do only one puff at a time because of the fight sword. And Bonta going for the double uh, pod eastern uh, header. If he just needs to get to the boss in each, he's already got the big key in both, he just needs to get to the boss. Uh, yeah, and highway actually... I think Highway may have a, a bit of a quicker time thanks to finishing with the Tower of Era. The question is just how much of Death Mountain will he check? Yep. There's two swords there. Unfortunately, I don't think... Uh, I think while you're there and checking like Paradox and uh, Hookshot Cave, it's like 11 checks. It's like 5% of the whole game is these two places. It no. may well go for that. For, uh, may well go for them. Now, it's also worth bringing up again. Key counts. Ryrick's a 4, Mont is a 2. I don't think either of them are in danger, per se, especially with a, a quick GT key. But if Bonta has to clear a lot of GT and there aren't really much for keys in there, which I'd be surprised, he could run into some key issues. And also, uh, for the Ganon fight, Bonta actually has the Lamp and Half Magic, which Raiwek doesn't. Oh, that is a good point. That is really, really tricky for Raiwek. If he goes there with only the Master Sword, that is going to be a really, really tricky fight. Yeah, and um, his Rupee count, even if he gets Silvers, oh, his yeah, no, Rupee count not... only gives him a few shots. Yep. Well, even three silver shots is, you know, well enough to, to, to gain some time, but it's not going to matter too much. But I think, yeah, I, I think magic and the lamp is going to be really, really important at the end of this of this match. I'm like actually checking Paradox, and I think it will check um, the Hookshot Cave too, so he will have the Temper Sword. I may eat my words in a few minutes, but... <laughs> Um, he will have the, the Master Soul, that's sure. So, yeah, I think... Just as a reminder for earlier, where Bonta found Half Magic and Lamp, they were both in Desert. That pendant desert that Sparrowick never touched. <laughs> uh, yes, might have me. They both found the Wooden Arrow uh, in uh, in the shop. So, ah, uh, we're getting uh, trolled by the, the little Stalfos uh, skeleton. And just uh, to actually just a reminder on that, there aren't going to be mimics to worry about in the climb. Yep. Well, they may well be mimics, but we are in the misers. That's true. 
And I'm actually having 16 hearts. That's unbelievable. Bro, does have his Master Sword, he's officially in go mode. Yep. And he may well have a, a third sword going up the mountain. That would be really, really interesting because it, it would give him an advantage uh, against Bonta with a sword, but he will lose time with magic. So in the end, it would, you know, kind of balance uh, the fight. Oh, I'm so hyped! <laughs> this is such a great yeah, match. This, if 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 Robert gets that tempered, he's got a big advantage. I think if he doesn't, it's going to be really close. Yeah, and Ryuk is actually checking this chest. Uh, it's it's fair play. If he finds the, the silvers, it's a gain of time. And if he finds a sword, it's, it's always, uh, always time uh, he won't lose. Yeah, a t a tempered or silver is really a big. He's not oh, checking it. Ah, I'm, I'm eating my own words. Ah, it feels so bad. <laughs> right, wait, come back, is, please. <laughs> there, there is still one more sword out there. We don't know where the fourth is. <laughs> yeah. It may well be in GT. And I think comparing this to... I think Highwick is going to be the first up there he just in GT. Quick, he has to do because a quick and kill we have the GTP key game to launch. Because Highwick, even though he's uh, right now... Ooh, that was a <laughs> nice clutch <laughs> little error part. You know what, Bonta did a... Absolute slaughter in that room uh, in, uh, in Eastern Palace. Wow, so many things happening at once. But yeah, Highwick is going to have his seventh, uh, seventh crystal. It did waste a key though, but he has four now, so he's all set for the rest. I'm not sure if we have a game we can play here, but I'll try to start it. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm actually a mod. Okay, so it works. Oh, oh yeah, mod. Oh, Stop. and Ravik falls on Moldorm. <sighs> That's kind of bad. But we actually launched uh, the GTPK game, so be sure to input uh, any number between 1 and 22 uh, to guess the location of the Ganon Tower Big Key. Get him in quick, because we'll basically be stopping as soon as Ryawick goes in. He's got... Bonta grabs his 7th crystal, Ryrek right behind him. Bont I'd say Ryrek's got maybe a minute, minute and a half advantage right now. Tiny, tiny bit of a... yeah, it's just, just, just a mountain climb, so it's, yeah, a minute and a half. And you hear Bonta mashing his button, wanting to go to the mountain. And Ryrek actually getting there first. So, twenty, well, like, 15 seconds to go for the game. Just as a quick reminder, I don't think Bont has lost this tournament yet. He went 10-0 in groups, and I don't think he's lost a game in the brackets. Uh, no, Bonta actually has a perfect, perfect tourney so far. He has uh, 10 wins and 0 losses in the group stages, and... Um... And uh, pop, 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 uh, yeah, not lost a single match in the brackets. Meanwhile, Raiwek has uh, had a bit more rough time during his tourney, but he is in the finals. And he is in front of his opponent right now, going to the right side of GT to hope to find his GT big key and beginning his ascension. With Bata, not. Uh, Bata no, did Go. realize the key situation went and bought an extra key before going into GT. You generally do want at least two, two before you go into GT. Oh yeah, that's true. Well, the anti fairies in that room are a bit troll. <laughs> it's a narrow place. Oh, the ice rod! Wow, what a place for it to be. There's another key. No. No big key oh. on the right side. If Bonta goes full left, he'll be fine. He'll gain a little time. Oh yes, and if you just joined, you are here for the uh, the finals of French Tourney. And this is a double header, meaning that this is the first match, and after this match, uh, they will wait. The players will wait ten minutes and go for the second match. So there won't be any interviews going uh, after this one. 
but only after the second one. Just so you know. <laughs> and now we're going to the Dark Magician room with the four chests and a cape. Ah, the cape is nice, but it doesn't have magic, so... And I don't think he has potions. So we'll need... I think he the... has one blue left. You think he has one blue left? Okay. That's good to know. But didn't he, didn't he use it uh, against Cold Stair? He Ooh, used that's... one. I think he had two. And there's the big key. You can count that out quick. One, two, six, seven... I think that was eleven? Uh, did he take the torch? He didn't take the torch, but he did look at it, so that counts. Oh yeah, true, 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 true. Uh, so, yeah. Two, four, one, seven, and it's... Uh, yeah, eleven, yeah. So, big key eleven. Oh, it's, it's Jean Berlin. The French... Uh... <laughs> The French guy. What do you know? Which I don't know. I, I think we might have a leaderboard. I think it's just. Uh... Uh, I think this is actually the the old uh, the old game, but Sass Robot is down. So this was just a uh, a way to play the game. The French guy. Well, one of the sixty-seven or something million French guys there is on the planet. <laughs> so, but it's part of the French community, yes. So, GG so Junior. This, at this point, we gotta really look at the situation. They both have Master Sword. They both have not found Silvers. And that magic advantage you were talking about with Fanta is coming in bigger and bigger. Oh yes. If he has to, no, I'm actually he has checking to do, some seconds. Oh, he's gonna take a spirit. That's a good idea. If um, yeah, if it comes down to a Master Sword Silver this Ganon fight. Ryweck is going to have to be incredibly efficient. And he can be. Uh, he may really well be. Uh, Ryweck can... Oh yeah, well, I think he's right to use his, uh, his bow now. It's the most efficient way, but yes. Bonta is going to creep up on him, uh, because I think execution-wise he may well be a bit better than Ryweck. Uh, even though yeah. Ryweck might, might be more resourceful. I'd say it's about a two-minute difference right now between these two. A uh, tiny bit, yes. Uh, so it's like 127, 22 in that uh, room with the conveyors and ice. 127, 22. We'll try to compare like this. But yeah, this is really tiny difference, and the Ganon fight may well give the win to Bonta or Raiwek, depending on how well Raiwek does, actually. He has his own, uh, his own, well, no, his own destiny. That's a bit too, uh, <laughs> too ceremonial. But uh, he has, uh, he has the win in his hands, and he can do it with a nice little setup for this Land Molas to trying to get the fire rod shots in there. Nice spins and nice fire shocks. Nice. Yeah, he's got to be very careful with his magic usage. He needs to light torches in a couple of rooms. Oh, yeah, he's going. Oh, yes, away. <laughs> you saw him. He saw him hesitate there with kind of what he's going to use to kill this because he really can't afford to use more magic. And unfortunately, the Kibdos is um, is immune to arrows, except, ironically enough, silver arrows. I'm going up this room. Yeah, Bonta is one minute twenty seconds behind Iwek. Uh, going into the room Bonta is in, so it may well change after the gauntlet and after the old GT Ascension. But it, this four, is a really, really close game. We got four chests upstairs still. If any of them has silvers or tempered, that's going to be a big, big relief for Ryweck. <laughs> yeah, uh, Veloka, that's exactly right. Um, you cannot get an enemy that cost, uh, need, uh, requires you to have an item. But these green eagles, actually, uh, you can kill them with a with a sword. <sighs> Iwek, don't die here. He takes the magic, doesn't despawn GT, it happened. It, and he's actually really close on health. He has the powder, so he could waste a bit of powder he, here, but he won't. He also he did, he did net a fairy, so that's, but he doesn't want to use that right now. <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah, because it's more than a loss of time, it's a loss of resources. Next room may be easy enough. Ooh, <laughs> it's oh. a bit glitchy, it's half a heart. And with a powder now. Well, no, the bunny beam doesn't change here, and that's good news for him. And ether, well, not really useful, is it? One more chance at either tempered or silvers. Yep. One tiny more chance, and it could well be a sword. With a seven-eyed Igor, uh, Igor, no, then a Trolldom. 130-25, Ryowick takes down Moldorn. <laughs> the blue meringue. <laughs> we have Master Sword Silverless fights coming up. <laughs> oh, jeez. This is going to be a really rough time psychologically for both of them. You know you're in finals. There's lots of pressure. And this Master Sword Silverless fights are not fun. Not in the least. Uh, I dare you to try them. It's a marathon. What a, how can I, I want to make setups like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just like... <laughs> no, but like, this is fine. This is going to be fun. Fun to watch. Let's play. Oh, I like miss, missing the... Missing the third... Uh, the three... Oh. Yeah, the triple on Agatou. But actually going... 3-1-2. Neat Agatou fight. Bonta creeping up on him. 131.25 at the end Bonta of Agatou. Is... two. Bonta's not opening chests. He's fine with Master and Sword Soul. And it is overing. And he falls. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was hyped for like uh, one second and a half, but you know. <laughs> this All is right. good news for Highwick. But tiny good news. Uh, he's going to okay. go by Potion. I, I think he's right. I think he doesn't have the... Uh, I this think he doesn't is... have the, the resources to finish it. This is time for Banta. Yep. Ryuk will still have the lead, but... I mean, between the difference between those, I out minute 45 and their Moldorm times, but this is time Banta is... or Ryuk's losing. And he can only buy two potions. He could buy a green one, but he doesn't choose two. Two blue potions is going to be more than enough for him, I think. And taking back the flute to flute four and into the court of the Iron Castle, <laughs> getting trolled, of course, if by Bonta, his soldier. If Bonta has a fast Aga 2 fight, they're going to be near identical times going into this Ganon fight. He may well just play out during this Ganon fight. And he actually gets a double, so Bonta did not win or lose any time on Raiwek during this Aga 2 fight. Never mind. 132.55, Ryback goes into Ganon. 52 spins. That's what he's oh, facing. Jeez. Oh, Ebonta actually messing up multiple faces of Act 2. And he is 1 minute 30 seconds behind Ryback uh, at the fade out of Act 2, but Ryback just went to go buy some potions. And now he's against the big Ganon. We're looking at about a 40 second difference between these two on the Ganon fights as Ryuk enters phase two. This is a really, really stressful match, even for the commentators. <laughs> what a great, great finals, first finals match. Going for the Master Sword spins, of course, because Ganon is immune to the slashes, unfortunately for them. A nice spot, and Ryuk in phase two already doesn't have magic to waste, quote unquote, uh, with a cape or some uh, some kind of form of protection. Just dodging everything they can, getting still, the spins in there. Still phase two for Ryuk. Bonsa Perhaps. doing some nice little setups with the Samaria block, getting some doubles in there. 134.15, Ryuk goes into phase 3. Oh, jeez. This is really, really close. Like, this is really insanely close, especially for the finals match. Ryuk chasing Ganon that's teleporting everywhere. Remember, Stop. They'll, both, they'll both have these same teleports. 
Yep, this is not. Yeah, this is RNG, but this does not count uh, for them. Bonds has got to watch his health a little bit. It's about a 30 second difference between them going into phase three. And the arrows weigh in the light world for some reason. Lawek, do not mess up. It did not yeah, mess up the torch glitch. <laughs> And let's go, 24 spins right now for Iwek, going into phase 4. Has the potions, has the fire rod, not the lamp, but more than enough magic. And it's nice triple setup for him. A bit in front of his opponent, Bonta. I, I haven't getting counted, I don't know where, their, I don't know where their, their spins are at this point. I, I never want to count, I just want a surprise. <laughs> yeah, I'm not counting. Oh yeah, I, right. I, I, I can't count. Right this is extra hype. This phase, but that's all we know. <laughs> yeah, he's a bit ahead, but not that much. And a cool word change. Uh, but Highwick is just doing so perfectly against Ganon, getting the triples in that fight. Oh, jeez. This is such an exciting time. Both of them with a Master Sword Silverless really just... Dreadful, perfect execution for both of them. Bonta with two and a half hearts could may well die. Uh, and both of them may die all four. But this is exciting. This is pro plays, of course. These Both of these players are really, really good at what they're doing. I think Rara's got one more fire rod shot. Uh, yeah, exactly one more. He has two blue potions, though. he's fine. And the slashes and the spins are getting there. I think Highwick is really, really close to killing Ganon. Yeah. Bonta is not that far too. This is anybody's game. Oh. Highwick Ganon actually exploding! Down. Ganon! Ganon goes down for Highwick. He is too far to fall, so... Going there. Wow, with an official time of 1.37 and 11 seconds, Raiwek just won the first match of these finals of the French Francophone tourney, getting the first defeat out of Bonta, who just finished also with, well, I'm just waiting a few seconds for him to, uh, to cross the bridge. With an official time of 1.37 and 39 seconds. 28 seconds of difference between the two players. And Raiwek actually getting the first match. GG. Wow. So we are going to actually have a quick interview because uh, Bonta is going to take a break between games. But we are going to be bringing Raiwek in momentarily. Raiwek will come for a short interview. Hello, Raiwek. GG. Hi. Uh, thank you. Wow, that was impressive. I know, so, right? <laughs> uh, that, was, that was hell impressive. That Ganon fight was marvelous. Perfect. Mm. GG. Thank wow. You. Uh, you, 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 it's well. It's the first time Bonta loses a match in that <laughs> tourney, and it happens in finals against you. you I know. Be... I I can't believe I took the victory here. It's it's surprising. I beat Bonta. I have bragging <laughs> rights now. <laughs> So what did you think of this seed, this awful little retro it, animizer seed? It was, it felt very dangerous, especially with me leaving. I'm supposing the lamp is in desert, I think. Lamp and half magic in desert. I mean, half magic, wow, that's, yeah. Because I was going into Ganon, yeah, sure, I have full magic, but it doesn't matter because there's no way I can get the torch glitch and hit him. Uh, for a triple in the first section. I had to go get potions. Everything was, ugh, so Wait, tight. Did you hear where the, th where the third sword we knew was? There's a third sword? Yep. Oh, yes, where, where in, where in Hookshot Cave. Oh, that hurts. That hurts so much. Uh, that, that hurts uh, us also. Like we, we were like, okay, so he goes to Paradox. He finds a sword. He may well go to Hookshot Cave and get a third sword. And Tepid Sword for Ganon would be perfect for him. And no, you just... Whatever. I, I, I was in go mode. <laughs> <laughs> I was I'm looking for silver, but yeah. I'm guess I'm trying to think where silvers were. Right? The only thing I can think of Light World was maybe bats. Was there anything else that we didn't? Uh, I don't even tablets. Know. I haven't done the tablets. It wasn't the tablets. No. Bonta no. Yep. Uh, it was only twenty rupees. So it's definitely not the pedestal. <laughs> 
definitely not a bit of stone. Yeah, that's that's all I got. It's probably magic bat then. Ah, it's true. Yeah, it may well be <sighs> magic bat. Oof, I am so hot. <laughs> oh yeah, I understand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm just I'm trying to think about back to that seed. I mean, if you you both had your moments, like you both basically got the you both got the boots really early. We we laughed because you both got those boots. So like you basically got them at the exact same moment. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I, I hesitated before going to Agina because I'm not, that's not my usual routing, but then I'm against Bonta. Bonta checks Agina. I better check Agina. Yeah. And I yeah, mean, and uh, we, we thought we both thought that uh, both of you would would think, well, my opponent never went there that early, so we got the boots. I got the boots before him. And you actually were absolutely sink. <laughs> wow. Um... Yeah, I think there's a lot of little things like you know, Bonta made that extra dip in the desert. Bonta double dipped ice. That definitely True. hurt. True. Ooh, yeah, that can hurt. Um, did, he, did he first clear Eastern the first time he went, or? Uh, no, actually. No. Okay. Uh, he, he did Everything the double, uh, <laughs> the, the double letter with a with a pod in Eastern. Yeah, right. I think you one shot Thieves Town. He also double dipped Thieves Town. Okay. Yep, he did. Not, not really double dip. But well, it's the first it, it, it half the and the second half. Yeah, yeah. He, did. Yeah. Yeah. he also did take a death in, in or not, not Eastern, sorry, Thieves Town, but he also okay. did take a death in Thieves Town too. Not a big death, but it did hurt <laughs> a little bit. Wow, I still, I, I won. I won. Any last questions uh, before yeah. we head over to the French Channel? Because uh, we do have to set up for our next race that's yeah. starting soon we as well. So we need to get you over there. Um, Merci beaucoup, I, Rayweck. Yeah, I think I think we're good. Yeah, head over there and get ready for your next race. Have you decided what your next race is going to be yet? Yes, it's going to be inverted Kisanity hard pool. Wow. <laughs> okay. yeah. well, have so. fun, quote unquote fun, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. All right, I'm heading out. Thank you so much to both of you for commentating. Appreciate Merci, it. Right, right. Thank you. Bye. Love you. Love you too. Well, that was a nice interview. Very, very high. Uh, that he was a bit of yeah. the underdog and. Uh, Wow, he's really, really liked, yeah. and he's yeah. going to go to the French channel. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So, just as a, he is now one win away from taking this tournament. Just as a reminder, it's online. Not only is it bragging where it's just being the champion of this tournament, it's also this is also for SG Live. That's scheduled to happen in mid-November. That the winner of True. this tournament gets uh, their, I believe it's their hotel and their flight covered. Uh, yeah, that's exactly right. So you get the um, you, you get the trip there uh, for the win. So and I think the German are doing the same kind of tournament right now. So this is uh, I believe going to be also a, there's also going to be an English one at some point, but I don't think that has uh, come together just yet. I think that's just kind of a stay tuned thing right now. Yep, uh, but thank you everyone for being with us for this first, uh, very first match. I don't know if the second one has yet been scheduled with uh, commentators in English. They actually has. We are going to have Gamer Cal and Sim Kirby on the call for game two. Hey, that's neat. Very hard to have a few uh, commentators in English for these finals. This is really, really hype, and especially since I won the first game. So we're looking at about, I'd say maybe around 15 minutes or so, maybe yeah. a little less. Yeah, 15, the or, next 15 game. or so pause because uh, Bonta is taking a pause. Raiwek is actually right now speaking in French in my ears because I have the uh, the French stream. <laughs> I need to lower it. Uh, and they have a 10 minute delay for the tourney. So yeah, 15, 20 minute pauses uh, before going to the second match. Yep, so. so yeah. Get a drink, relax a little bit, and get exactly. right, be right back here. Be right on this channel in about 15 minutes. <laughs> well, I'm putting the links. You, of course, should follow Bonta and Raiwek to see great, great gameplay from both of them. Uh, you actually have the uh, the links for the, the French, uh, the Francophone community uh, attorney with Discord Extra if you want to join and play some. A link to the past randomizer, but with French speaking people. We are, well, some of us speak English and actually c come here and to commentate and it was really really a great pleasure to be here with you uh jp really really fun 
Yep, really good to commentate with you as well. Also, thanks to our commentator, or not commentator, our, our tracker, you, I think it was Yukikaze. Yeah, Yukikaze, yeah. Yep, thanks to them <laughs> for keeping track of everything. <laughs> Yeah, I think it was for for once uh, the uh, the tracking is done on the French side, well, the Frankfurt side. So <laughs> for once, it's uh, it's done like that. But thank you very much, JP, for for the commentating. That was really really fun. Uh, I really had a blast. It's such a great match. Uh, very happy to commentate for once in English uh, on Speed Gaming. Yeah, thanks. Well, and uh, I think we should just let other people take a break and yeah, be back here in 15 minutes for game two. Thank you, everyone, and bye-bye.